Hi, my name is Chris Millington. I'm a model from Glasgow and this is my River Island Masterclass. If I were to give anyone any advice about becoming a model, I think the first thing that, that you have to consider is your, your self-confidence. If you're confident in the way that you look, then absolutely, you're, you're probably ready to go and have a go at it. Um, if, you, if you don't really feel confident in how you look, then the first thing to do is to find a look, whether that be a different hairstyle or, or whatever it is that you want to do, if you want to work on your physique, anything at all. You need to have the belief in yourself, and the first thing that I would tell anyone to do is to speak to model agencies. That's, that's the best advice that anyone can give you. Um, because ultimately they're the guys that are going to sign you to their books if they think that you have a strong enough look. They will be able to give you the best advice. So today I've been modelling for the RI Cycle Collection. As a model you have to travel around central London and cities uh, quite a lot, going to castings and go sees and, and meet different people. Um, and I've found that it's quite difficult to do that. Um, if you're using a bike, if you're wearing cycling gear, you have to change and you need to be presentable when you arrive at a casting. And I think that this collection is very, very relaxed. So personally, I think that my favourite piece from the new collection is the one that I'm wearing at the moment. It's just the jersey sweatshirt and it's a really, really simple piece. Um, it's got a few extra little details which I think really add to it. Really basic, but it does have little loops here. Um, that you can put your thumb through which help of course if you're cycling and stuff to keep your hands warm um, and it's got some zip detailing at the back which also adds a little bit of effect um, but yeah I like it a lot it's just really simple. For me um, my grooming routine is, is really actually straightforward um, when it comes to my hair I'll use a, a reworkable pliable pomade and um, it's easily combed through so if I've been cycling uh, through the city to go to different places I can take my helmet off and my hair might be out of place but all it takes is just a quick comb through and for the beard there isn't really much that, that you need to do other than just take care of the hair itself um, make sure that you shampoo it and condition it as often as you do with your hair um, you can have beard balms or beard oils that you can purchase online um, and what they do is they moisturise the hair itself all the way down to the root and then that keeps the skin underneath the hair quite healthy as well. Uh, so thank you for watching my masterclass. I hope that the tips I've given you today are 